if you have a two-prong receptacle, you technically have to replace it with another two-prong receptacle. Unless you install a GFCI receptacle in its place. So these should actually come with labels inside that say no ground, basically. But this makes it so that you can have that third prong and if you do have a short from the hot to the ground prong, the GFCI receptacle will automatically trip, giving you kind of some of the same pr protection that you would have had uh, with a regular grounded plug. But if you're just going to throw in a standard receptacle, you're creating a major hazard because the if there is a short from the hot, which is the narrow prong, to the ground, then it's uh, not going to have any return path and the entire frame of the appliance is going to be energized at 120 volts. So just remember, if you're going to replace a two-prong receptacle, you need to go back with another two-prong or install a GFCI and label it as having no ground.